Okay, welcome back to Afrikaans for Beginners, Lesson 3. This lesson will be easier if you've done Lessons 1 and 2, but this is not essential. We're going to learn about questions. The questions, what, where, and who. Now remember, in Afrikaans, when you see the letter W, it is pronounced V, just like the English letter V. So put on your Afrikaans hat and remember, W is V. Var means where. Var. Notice the long A sound there with the double A's. Can you say it with me? Var. V means who. Or even whom. V. Notice the short I sound. Say it with me. V. What is what? 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 Just remember, the word D means the. D. Now that you've learned those four simple Afrikaans words, we're ready to start asking questions. Put your Afrikaans hats on and let's hoi. Our first question is, Var is die lamp? Now what do you think it means? Var is die lamp? Var is die lamp means, where is the lamp? Did you guess it right? Let's see if we can do that with other questions. Var is die ink? Var is die ink? Now what does that mean? Var is the ink means, where is the ink? Are you getting the hang of this? Well, let's carry on. Var is the water. Where is the water? Var is the water. And finally, var is the dam. Where is the dam? Var is die dam. Wie is die man? Who is the man? Wie is die man? Wie is die student? Who is the student? Wie is die student? V is blind. Who is blind? V is blind. V is intelligent. Who is intelligent? V is intelligent. V is by the dam. Who is by the dam? V is by the dam. What is by the dam? What is by the dam? What is by the dam? How about what is in the dam? What is in the dam? What is in the dam? What is warm? What is warm? Remember to roll your R's. Roll your R's, dear. What is warm? What is by the bed? What is by the bed? What is by the bed? Now remember, that D at the end of the word is pronounced like a T. And so the word bet sounds exactly like the English word bet, as in take a bet or gamble. What is by the bed? What is by the bed? What? Drink the man. What is the man drinking? What drink the man? Ooh, 
That's just a little tricky, isn't it? Did you notice how this grammatical structure is not exactly like English? Now, why is that? Well, if you watch our next lesson, you'll find out. And we'll also find out how to use verbs or doing words just like drink. See you again soon. Now, if you found this video helpful or informative or enjoyable, I would really love it if you liked, subscribed, and hit the notification bell so that you can be informed when I next upload videos. Till we see each other again, thought scenes.